What is going on guys, DBG here, and again, this is another video of a card that I, um, well, I already have it, but, um, I don't already have the card, but it's another free card video, so this is a, um, card that you can pick up in the 2K TV collection. Okay, so to get this card, you go to 2K TV. There we are. So you skip basically until you see this section, Glenn Robinson the third. And, okay, so the question asks, what year did he win the slam dunk contest? I'm fairly sure he was a rookie last year, so the answer is 2017. If you haven't answered that, if you've answered it wrong, of course, you can't get the card. But if you haven't answered it yet, actually get the card. So you go into my team and the pack should be there in your rewards queue. Um, I will open these league packs eventually, but like their initial start of the year league packs where you can't even get moments cards. So I keep forgetting, there's no point ever buying them start of the year. When you get a Sapphire card... I think this is the second last of these free Sapphire cards, and it's Glenn Robinson the third. So we put Glenn Robinson the third into the team. I've got to run Alonzo with the one, JR with the two, Robinson with the three, Porzingis with the four, Bender with the five. With the bench, we're going to go with Harden, Kobe, Jonathan Isaac, Boris Diaw, and Thon Maker. Um, leave a like in this video if you guys want to see a Boris Diaw gameplay. I really want to use this card because he just looks like a beast. But um, yeah, so let's go over the stats of Glenn Robinson the third. 81 defense, 91 offense, overall to the three goal badges, a post riser, catch and shoot, lob city finisher. He has got, well, he's 6'6", six six, small forward. He's got an 89 open shot mid, 87 open shot 3, 86 ball control, 6 speed boost. He has got good lateral quickness of, well, decent lateral quickness of 79. This card would have been really good to start the game. Bad on ball defense, IQ, 98 driving dunk, 100 tendency. Good speed and acceleration, okay speed with ball. This card would have been a beast to start the year, but, like, stats-wise does not look like it's too great, to be completely honest. But anyway, we're going to go for his hot zones anyway. Hopefully, he doesn't have a broken release like last year because that would be a disaster. So, Glenn Robinson the third does not have any hot zones outside of 3 point line, but has a lot of mid-range hot. His release, uh, not great. Last year's was broken, but it's definitely still on the longer side. It is definitely still on the longer side, this release. Um, I don't think it's the same anyway. But, um, yeah, this is quite long. See, dunk animations. At least this year's speed with ball is high. I remember last year, for some reason, he had a really low speed with ball, and he was just really clunky to use. But, um, alright, just release. Definitely on the long side. But, um, he's gonna be mainly a dunker, I guess. This card, I'm definitely gonna struggle using this card. Unless he can just go and jam it on everybody. I might end up playing with the power forward at some stages. Just run, with, run pick and rolls with him. Because it doesn't look like he's gonna be doing too much in game. That's a nice dunk, though. So, yeah, let's just green 1 3, and then we're gonna get on to the game. Come on, let's green one. Another good release. Full white bar, or full bar, which apparently isn't a good release. Even though it's as close to green as you can get. Come on, come on. And now let's get on to the game. All right, we're playing against mostly a diamond team, but I'm not worried. For some reason, he's got the 6-7 Wes Unsell, the center, with the 7 foot Akeem, a power forward. Bench, all right, I guess. Uh, Michael Jordan um, Amethyst card is good. That's weird. He must have a very good shoe on that Michael Jordan Amethyst, but um, we should be okay, hopefully. The. Um, oh, we got him. We got him pulled from mid, and he knocks it down. And we have the Thon Maker, who's a beast. I, I really like that Thon card. That Thon's really good. We got the Kenny Smith, the Ruby. The only Ruby uh, next. We then got Marquise Chris, who can dunk, can shoot threes. And he's big as well. And now we're after getting Glenn Robinson, who's probably... Of the least... Uh, well, of the cards, the least I was looking forward to. But, like, probably a lot better than Greg Anthony. Oh, my God. That's the worst pass I've seen in my life. Just dive. Good job. Oh, is, is that what it's like in America? Um, Does a backward violation... Is that always taken from the halfway line? Because in Europe, it's from wherever it's uh, tipped from. So, for example, if you tip it right beside the basket, it's taken closer to the basket. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's only 3-2, but come on. Good job, Dragon Bender. Let's go, Robinson. Good rebound. To the basket. Spin in. Maybe you can get something from this. Nope. He's so slow. Oh, it's free. I just got to keep saying this card is free. The card is free. To the basket, please. Oh, my God. Oh, it's... We've been spoiled with the free cards we've gotten. 
The only reason this card's in any way useful is to get that Tobias Harris card, which actually looks quite good, to be fair. This guy's terrible as well. Like, we're down 3-2, and this guy sucks. Please, please, go wide open, and he knocks it down. That release is super long, though. Going on three, Kobe Bryant, and he ties the game. Come on, no. Damn, we are now down 15 to 7. Like, this guy, I'm not changing my opinion. This guy sucks. So if we lose, this will be a disaster. Somebody's got to be open. But Dia decides to play in the exact same position as someone else on his team. Like, I know he made that layup, but why are there two players standing on the same wing and nobody decides to, that it's a good idea to move into the center, which is wide open? Although, it is going to be hard to chip away at this game when, we have, when we're running through Glenn Robinson. He's slow. He's got a slow release. He can't really shoot. He doesn't dunk that often, to be honest. Like, I know he just have to get an M1 there, but he hasn't even attempted to dunk most of the time. Um, yeah, it's knocked down his free throw. 70% chance. I don't think I've seen that on a non-center in so long. To the corner. The three. Good wide open. And a, we missed a good open shot off a Hall of Fame dimer pass. Gotta say that at least once a video. I throw a cut, fakes him up. And misses the layup. He gets his own board though. Fake. You've got to be kidding me. That was a fake. Good stand. And we pass out a jumper and get it. That's rare. That's rare. Good stand. You gotta get that board. Good rebound, Bender. Push it. Glenn Robinson from two. And Glenn Robinson misses the good wide open shot. Come on. This card is garbage. Like, it's bad for a free card. And they go and hit a three on us. Like, this is a nearly the impossible gameplay to get anything decent with Glenn Robinson because this card's so bad. Good wide open. There we go, Porzingis. Why? Why two of yous run in? Please, please get a dunk. There we go, Glenn Robinson. That's the one thing you can do is dunk. Keep doing that. Please. There we go. Glenn Robinson's done okay in the second quarter. It's all right. Six-point game at halftime. Should be... Actually, it could be a lot worse. Could be better. Could be a lot worse, to be honest. Good defense. Let's go, Jonathan Isaac. And we do currently have... Four guys on the floor can speed boost. Jonathan Isaac blows the dunk, but Diaz there at the board. Jonathan Isaac eventually lets go of the ring. Fake. Good job by him. Unlucky, he just slightly misread that. He didn't buy the fake from Diaz. You want to go in? We're going to hit. Shoot out to Hall of Fame, Diner pass. Full court press. Oh, five point game. Unfortunately, Glenn Robinson the third is not a player I really want to run much through. Alonzo for three. Alonzo ball knock misses the three. Oh, I thought that bounce looked good. Like we're too slow to even go stop start on him. <laughs> I know his speed's in the 80s, but he's clunky. Like, you know, there's some players with low speed ratings, but they're just not clunky, so they feel much higher. He's clunky, so we feel slower than he is. We're there. No, we had two, we had two seven foot one plus players trying to block that dunk. Not even Vince Carter in 2000 would have been able to make that in real life. Please, please, please. No, you missed the dunk. Bench, get in for the rest of this game. If this goes in, it's probably game over. With now 10 points. Oh my god, this card is terrible. He can't even dunk. He's there to do one thing and he can't even do it. J.R. Smith falls away. Terrible shot and J.R. Smith hits it. Draymond Green for two, I think. And we deserve to miss that. We hit that crazy shot with J.R. So we deserve to miss that one there. We're there. No, that's not a foul. Like, that is not a foul. He's just running in a straight line at me. Hall of Fame diver pass. Slightly late. No, that was a terrible miss. Now it's three points. And they have the ball. That was, a, that was probably a game-changing miss right there. No, 
No, we should have been there, Jonathan Isaac. Straight line, please, Thon Maker, on the straight line. Ku coach. Three. And Ku coach knocks it down. That's a terrible shot. That's a terrible shot. And Jonathan Isaac comes out with the board. They go and hack us. Okay. Ku coach coming out of the game. Because it's a gameplay for him, he's coming back in the game. Even no matter how bad he was, Glenn Robinson the third is ending this game. We are literally gonna double off. Hakeem. Don't oh, triple team! Why did you triple team at the halfway line, Thon Maker? We already had a double team. That is dumb. That is dumb. Oh my god. And we lose by six in the end. Ugh. That's me done for today. I think I might take a day or two off this game because I'm just so, so frustrated after that. I was so pissed off there, I didn't even look at the box score. But Glenn Robinson. 11 points in 11 minutes. He shot two of five from the field. So he shot five of 15 from the field. Two turnovers, 0 of four from three. This card is terrible. But like for less than a thousand coins at the small four position, you guys can pick up a Bogdanovich, limitless range. You guys can pick up a Badia, lockdown defender, 95 open shot three with nice release. You guys can pick up an OG and an OB. And then you even got a Sapphire as you guys can pick up a Ben Simmons who dunks it better than Glenn Robinson. A Michael Beasley who dunks as well as Glenn Robinson can shoot and is faster. Just a much better version of Glenn Robinson because of his release. And even you go to the Emeralds. They're probably a little bit more expensive now, but like Maggetti or Jalen Brown Emerald is better than this Glenn Robinson. So this card, like, I know it's free, so I'm going to say to get it because of the collection. But I'm so disappointed because the Thon is really good. The Marquis Chris was good. The Kenny Smith was good. This Glenn Robinson card is just terrible. So anyway, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.